Okay, so you may have waited to the very last minute to get prepared for this eclipse coming up on August 21st. So what you're going to need is a shoe box of some sort, or any kind of box. Um, then you're going to need something to cut with, a sheet of aluminum foil, a pen, a piece of paper, and some tape. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to cut a hole on one end. And then on that end where we cut that hole, we're going to place that aluminum foil over it. Now I've got the hole cut out on the end of the box. I'm going to take the aluminum foil and I'm going to tape it on the outside of the box covering this hole. It doesn't need to look pretty, it just needs to be functional. Alright, the aluminum foil has been taped to the outside of the box. Next step, I'm going to take this sheet of paper and tape it right there on the inside of the box. The paper has been taped to the opposite end from the aluminum foil. So what we'll end up doing is we'll put a hole here in the aluminum foil, a little tiny pinhole, which will project the image of the sun onto this piece of paper. And I'm going to cut a hole over here for viewing. So there's my little viewing window. So what happens is you close the box up. You aim this end at the sun with the little pinhole and you look through this hole that you cut out on the side to see the little piece of paper which is where the sun will be projected. Right now it's a little cloudy so I can't really do an example yet. Clouds should be moved soon so I'll do a, a test example in a minute. Not sure if you can see it, but there's the little pinhole I made. And the sunlight's going to go through that. And project onto the white piece of paper that I taped into the back. So now I'm just waiting for the sun and we'll do a demonstration. Alright, I got a break in the clouds, so aim this end towards the sun. There's the sun right there. And that's how you're going to view the eclipse. You can see the clouds just covered it. Yeah, it doesn't look like I'm going to have a long enough break in the clouds here. This box may not have been the best box to make the eclipse uh, viewer for. As you can see, there's a hole along the edge which allows more light in. Kind of washes out the sun a little bit. I mean, if this is all you got, it'll work for viewing the eclipse. There's the sun projected onto the piece of paper through the pinhole. If you hold on a second, I got more clouds coming. You can watch them eclipse the sun. There's the clouds covering the sun. So that is your pinhole solar eclipse viewer. See if the sun pops back out. Yeah, there it is. So there you have it. That's your eclipse viewer. Thanks for watching.